Apple auto enhances captured photos using the deep fusion image processing algorithm and there's no direct way of disabling this. But in this video I'll show you some tricks that may help bypass this feature. And for this video we are using iPhone 14 Pro Max but this will work for any models that have the auto enhance feature. We'll start by turning off the full HDR view from photo settings. So let's open settings, then scroll down and find photos, open it, scroll down and, and we need to turn off view full HDR because it adjusts the display while showing you the photos. After we have turned that off, check if it's solved for you. And after that, we'll go back and enter camera settings. From here, we'll turn on use volume up for burst. After it's enabled, press down the volume up button while you're using camera to take burst photos and this may not be affected by the auto enhance feature. And then we'll scroll down and turn on prioritize faster shooting. If it's on then your photo will take short time to load and it may not apply the auto enhance feature that way. And some of you may have an option called smart HDR. If you see that then also disable it and check if it fixes your problem. And we can also use the live mode on the camera app to take photos and it will take the photo exactly as you see it on the screen. After you've taken a live photo open it and hit edit. Now tap on live and then select a key photo that you want to save. You may be able to bypass the auto enhance feature taking the photo this way. Hopefully these workarounds will resolve the auto enhance issue for you. Otherwise we'll just have to wait for Apple to listen to us. Thank you for watching. If you find this video helpful, leave a like and subscribe and we hope to see you soon.